I'm Anil Kumar. We will now consider composite function where one of the function has restrictions on both domain and range. We are given f of x equals to square root of x minus 2 and g of x equals to 3x. We need to write equation of y equals to f of g of x and write domain range of that function. Right? So let's begin by writing the composite function f of g of x. It really means f of what is g of x? It is 3x. So f of 3 of x. Now f of x is square root of x minus 2. Therefore f of 3x will be replace x with 3x. So what we get? We get square root of 3x minus 2. So that becomes the composite function. Right? Now from here we can write domain and range of the composite function. Composite function f of g of x as we found earlier is square root of 3x minus 2. Now domain of this function should be that within the radical sign square root sign we should always have non-negative number right. So the domain to calculate we can equate 3x minus 2 to greater than or equal to 0 and solve for x. That is to say 3x is greater than or equal to 2 or x is greater than or equal to 2 over 3. And therefore we can write that the domain of the function is equals to x belongs to real numbers where x is greater than or equal to 2 over 3. Now as far as the range is concerned we know for a square root function range is always greater than or equal to zero. So y belongs to real numbers where y is greater than or equal to zero. So that becomes the range of the given function. I hope that helps. Thank you and all the best.